Hi guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Through the Looking Glass. For those of you that are new here, hi, my name is Let's Play. For our returning viewers, as always, thank you so much for coming back to support my channel. It really means so much. All right, guys. Um, yeah. So, welcome. I am doing okay this week. A lot better than last week. Um, life was really overwhelming for a few weeks. Um, and I felt really very much so, um, like I just didn't have kind of control of any of the stuff going on and overwhelmed and all of the things that go along with that. Um, I feel a lot better this week, um, or at least the anxiety is different this week and a more fun version, I guess, if that makes sense. Um, this is my last week of work before me and Amelia head off on our trip. So that's super excited. We're getting so close. Um, I'm very excited. Um, but with that excitement also comes anxiety, which is probably, I think, the most confusing thing. Sorry guys, I feel like something got in my eye after I hit record. Um, but I feel like sometimes that's one of the most confusing things for people, um, both who are experiencing it, like having the conflicting feelings um, or for outside people being like, how are you anxious if it's something you're looking forward to? So I just was going to talk about that a little bit, um, today, cause that is very much so how I feel. Um, when I'm very excited for things, I greatly look forward to them, but I also get very anxious. Um, and just worried about getting everything done, forgetting things, navigating the airport, all the things that come along with travel. Um, especially when I'll be, you know, just me and her with not another adult to help like navigate things, stuff like that. Um, I know it will be fine. I navigated the airport by myself just fine. So it's not like I haven't done that before. Um, but it's just always that feeling, um, that I get, I can't help it. That's just how my brain works. The anxious brain, um, likes to play tricks. So I do my best to keep it at bay. I have lists. I have things I need to get done throughout the week. Um, and all of that. And it's, it's just a lot though. My brain goes on to overload. Um, we did start packing a little bit this weekend and trying to get things together. Um, which in and of itself is a whole, I'm going a very different time of year than I've ever gone. Um, the only time I haven't been in October my whole life was when we were in the marathon and it was unseasonably hot the week we were there for the marathon. We set like records with heat for the race and all of that. Um, so I am not used to the cooler Florida weather um, and watched stuff all this past week that had kind of similar weather forecasts um, as our week. And people were like bundled up. So it just makes packing a little bit different um, for me because obviously winter heavy clothes take up a lot more space in suitcases. So just trying to figure out what we need. Um, all of Amelia's clothes that she wants to wear are like tank top dresses. So finding like leggings or long sleeve shirts we can throw under them in the mornings when it's cold. Um, I'm like trying to come up with a plan for all of that stuff. Um, but we got a bunch of stuff together this weekend. Um, you know, Saturday I've obviously like finish, finish, because I'll do laundry and get socks and underwear, stuff like that, um, together. But I, I'm glad we have a lot of it together. I'm going to do a little bit more today with like going through ears and figuring out what couple pairs of ears we're going to take. Um, and like I said, I have a lot of, almost all of my clothes are packed minus like socks, underwear, stuff like that. And then toiletries. Um, Amelia, we still have to pack up some sweatpants and stuff once we do laundry for the week because we have freezing cold weathers here and she will not wear jeans. So we have that going on, but still very excited. Um, I'm sure this week will drag by. Um, but yeah, other than that, not a ton. I've been having a lot of anxiety with the weather. Um, but all of my anxiety right now is very like situational and not like constant. So that is, um, a little bit easier for me to deal with because it is just what it is and there's nothing I can change. Um, so I just work through my facts and do my best. Um, 
last week we had some really horrible weather, tons of snow, roads were not great, um, and that always makes me nervous. I am fairly confident that I just go slow and steady and I'm fine driving, but I always worry about other people who drive reckless or don't know how to drive in the snow very well. Um, but again, it is just what it is. We look like we have one more real bad day of weather tonight into tomorrow um, morning, so that is a little bit nerve-wracking for me. We're supposed to get a bunch of ice. Um, it's supposed to rain and then freeze, and we have a really big ice warning in our area. So tomorrow morning's commute could be dicey, and that's always what worries me. Um, so yeah, especially if I end up having to drive Amelia somewhere, it freaks me out having her in the car when the weather's bad. Um, if people can't come to her and we have to go to people, it just gives me that extra, extra dose of anxiety. But hopefully this is the last day we have to deal with it for a while. Um... But yeah, that's what's been going on here. <laughs> um, I still have been like slightly overwhelmed. I did get stuff marked off my to-do list this weekend though. Um, I haven't been procrastinating as much and like overwhelmed as much. So we're definitely going in the right direction. Um, but yeah, life is just hard sometimes and it's going to happen. I don't think I have much else, but I just wanted to hop on um, before I go pick Amelia up from school and kind of share where we're at this week. Um, I keep thinking I'm going to get a video filmed for Saturdays and get a Disney video up, um, but I have not been great about getting that done, so I doubt I'll get it done for this Saturday, but maybe. We'll see. Maybe Amelia wants to film a little video about what we're doing and share some of our itinerary with you guys. Um, Otherwise, we'll be gone for the week next week, um, just playing and having fun down in Florida. Um, we have a lot of exciting things, some of which she doesn't know yet, so I'm excited to see her reaction to a couple of the surprises. Um, but yeah, that's all we have, guys. I hope you have a great week. I hope if you are like me and not having the best weather, you're able to stay safe and warm. And until next time, guys, bye!